today's episode of Destination Meghalaya, we will take you to a village called Maulingbana that is almost 20 kilometers from Mausandram. From Shillong to this destination, it will take you less than 3 hours to reach there. Maulingbana is a popular tourist spot for its lake called Umkakoi and today this is the place we're going to explore. On reaching here from the entrance, you'll have to pay an entry fee and there's a parking spot right at the entrance. As you walk towards the lake, you will find the whitish rocks with water collected holes in them and it will lead you right to the lake where you'll find the Umkakoi Lake. Lake Umkakoi has got its name from the tiny fish called Kakoi, which is particularly found in abundance in this lake. The expanse of this lake makes it a good place for swimming, kayaking, fishing, angling and lots more activities. The main attraction of this place is the river trekking, which you will need a guide and they will take you to numerous spots where you can slide, dive, go for cliff jumping, swim under their safe supervision. But of course, it is mandatory for you to wear your life jackets in every activities in the lake for safety. This place has two cliff jumping spots and here at this spot tourists can dive from a 45 height cliff which looks thrilling and so much fun. Your safety will always be taken care of by the train guides of this place.
you can also enjoy a trek in the lap of nature in the nearby sacred grove or the Lao Adong. For those who would want to stay, they provide cottages with good accommodation and food at reasonable prices. Next to the Umkakoi Lake, there is a tourist spot which is owned by a local man. Here you can come for picnic and sightseeing. It has a children's park, it is extremely cleaned, very well maintained and a very nice place for relaxing. From this private spot, you can get the view of the lake. You can also see these tiny bridges, cemented and also made from wood. This place is also very calm and very soothing. The village Maulingbana has numerous beautiful places like these which you can explore. There's a fossil park, sacred grove, split rock, rivers and waterfalls. So if you wish to visit this place, spare yourself at least two days to enjoy the natural scenic beauty that this place has to offer. And yes, viewers, here we have with us our visitors from the neighboring state of Assam. So uh, we'll have a talk with them. So first of all, ma'am, would you introduce yourself? Hello, my name is Stella and I'm from Guwahati, Assam. All right. So uh, since when have you arrived here? Uh, we came yesterday night in the evening. I think we reached around uh, nine-ish. And then uh, we thought of doing the water track and then all the adventure sports here. So I tried to do the first uh, cliff jumping that I could, but the second one I failed. <laughs> I was a little scared because, uh, you know, I wanted a little more motivation maybe. And then I saw it was really high. But then, yeah, maybe after practicing two, three times in the smaller cliff, I would be able to do the longer one. <laughs> all right. So what is the most adventurous thing that you've done here in this place? Here, I think that will be the cliff jumping. Oh, all right. the first time I have ever done it in my life, that's why I really liked it. it was very nice. Okay, so are you planning to visit this place again or yes, maybe yes, recommend your friends? Yes, I'll recommend it to my friends and also, yeah, I'll come again. <laughs> thank you, so have fun. Thank, thank you, you so much. much. Thank, thank you, thank you. For each and every activity here, you will have to hire a guide and they'll provide you all the necessities for your adventurous time. For kayaking, life jackets, for treks, for each and every activity, it is mandatory that you will have to hire a guide.
Uh, my name is Siddharth. Um, I'm from Guwahati and we just visited here yesterday. The first time being here. But I really like the ambience of the place. You know, uh, I really li like the trek we had, like the water trek. It was, the tra trail was really fun. And you know, and all the people are really supportive as well. Yeah. You know, you know, you don't have any, you face much difficulties while crossing these places. So, uh, which other place, places have you visited here? Yet, so uh, we are just staying over the cottages right there, and let's see what's in store for us for the entire day. All right. So, uh, what is the most adventurous thing that you have done here, and Mom? Uh, I could tell that I didn't jump from up on the cliff, but <laughs> you know, the the observation was enough for me. You know. <laughs> okay, so overall you're having fun here. Yeah, 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 def most definitely. Okay, thank you so yeah, much, Sudan. Yeah, thank, thank you. you. Umkakoi Lake is often packed with local tourists during winters, but in summers, people from our neighboring states, other states of our country, and locals too, they come to this place for sightseeing, picnic, and adventures. We are told that the best month to visit this place is in the month of June as it is perfect for various water sports activities like canoeing, diving and river trekking. I'm Vishal, I'm from Guwahati. Alright, so Vishal, uh, how are you enjoying uh, Meghalaya? Uh, it's very much fun. It was a very nice experience coming all the way. The trek was really nice. Oh. I did not cliff jump, but I should have. <laughs> <laughs> tomorrow I'm planning, but they say tomorrow is a holiday, so they won't be here. So maybe next time I will. Okay. What about the accommodation and everything in this place? Yeah, how is it? It's nice. Uh, we st we're staying in that cottage nearby. So it's nice to, uh, I definitely recommend everyone to come here. All right, thank you so much for your time. Thank you. So last question for you Stella, what would be the message that you would like to send to the other viewers who are watching okay, this show? I would like to say to anybody coming here for the first time, I think you should use this place very mindfully, keep it clean as the locals have kept it clean. So also learn from this, maybe when you take this message back home and maybe you know practice this thing at home like to keep your surrounding clean, I really like Meghalaya because of that. Yes, it's no littering and people are very very clean and mindful about this and I really liked it. That's so sweet. Thank you so much, Della. <laughs> Thank you.
This beautiful place Mauling Banai is not only packed by visitors from outside the state but it is also packed by our local visitors. So we'll have a talk with them right now. So fin pri thoi le di fi kuteng kumu. Kuteng bat ku parem bai. Bernadette's ear. Lari hun mar banyang. Okay, pi wan nasha. Ina sha bhoi. Te kumnu pi wan nasha mingko. Kasin ban kong iwan sine. Hot. Te kumnu pi sngos pa ne ga jaka. Ka sutanat ba kham tam ba di jaka balong ka pengat. Sebab mentah ke di ke ayam bempat selap dan yuk bannya jenyi ayah kumnya. Sustanat. Sebab di ke sian ke ban kong ban poi sian ke jaka. Ke jaka ke long ke itanat ke kidin ke jerngam ayah long pengat dah. Namar ba mentah dang lak di sedang ke porsit. Ya, yang wan lekai um sini mo. Kedai hot. Tapi ada pilih paham yang selagi yang pin dang, like pin recommend yang kita perlu jumpa bikin wan cash ni. Oh, obviously ingin ingin recommend. Ni lak pun wan biang ru. Tapi nak ni kis pot sebagai lekai ni pisung tenat tam kei. Banjingi. Banjingi. Kata ini wan kerang sini ru di banjingi. Tapi kau beli si bun eh mo, ya kau perlu jumpa. Thank you so much. Long three hours journey to reach this place will be a little tiresome, but the moment you witness the greenery and the beauty of this place, it will all be worth it. Well, viewers, in today's episode of Destination Meghalaya, we have explored this wonderful lake called Umkhakoi. And this place, it has not only the scenic beauty, but it offers lots more activities that you can enjoy and have fun and have a lovely day in this place. So, well, that's all we have for you today in today's episode of Destination Meghalaya. And until we meet again, bye-bye for now.